and musicians Kurt Darren and Chris Chameleon to mention a few. And if those names are not a big enough hint of what the Jigs Thorne directed movie's debut is all about, let me paint a brief picture for you. It's an hilarious reality TV style comedy which takes us into the lives of a lovable yet delusional Johnny and Carl, the main members of the band called uh, Stone Cold Jane Austen, the director of the film Jigs Thorne. Join well, it's not him, it's Rob from Fury who joins me in the studio. Rob, um, you have this way of interpreting things that is slightly left of normal. <laughs> <coughs> Thank you. That was very <laughs> subtly put. Thank you. <laughs> you know, when is that a nice way of saying I'm crazy? <laughs> you know, it's whenever true, you, it's true. <laughs> whenever you have the, whenever you take a character, you you take it just beyond normal. <laughs> and I and I don't want, I know to be talking about a new movie, but I just want to reflect on composites. In composites, you played this completely almost a whack but also a reality character that if you had to switch bodies the next day that's probably how you would react how do you find these really interesting ideas and how do you then interpret it in a very Rob Van Fearing kind of way gee I don't know um, I guess the, uh, projects kind of come my way and I'm lucky enough to be associated with some really interesting amazing people and um, the director and writer of this movie John Savage uh, is a, one of those really interesting, crazy people. He came to me with this project about, I don't know, two and a half years ago, and he said, I'm not sure what this is, if it's a TV show or a, or a um, web series just yet, and I thought he was crazy, I thought the idea was crazy, but I thought, well, it sounds like fun, let's do it. Two and a half years later, it turned out to be a movie. It should never have been a movie. It was like, a, it, it, the, the whole project sh in, a, in a normal world should not have happened. But it somehow did because of John's um, courage, his drive, his determination. And the fact that uh, the movie itself is just really interesting and fresh and new. And I'm, I just try to keep um, my performances as kind of grounded and as real mm. as possible um, in this crazy world that the, the movie takes place in. Okay, so it's a very crazy world. Talk to me about this band, it's Stone Cold a, Jane Austen. They, they're a band who, who kind of grew up in, the, in Belleville around the same time that um, the Polisicar guys were, yeah. got really big. And the story goes that the Polisicar guys stole all their moves, stole all their songs, just changed them into Afrikaans and became this huge hit. So there's been this bitter rivalry between these two bands for years. Stone Cold Jane Austen never got the, the recognition they deserved. So now they've decided to make a comeback and they've decided to sing in Afrikaans and tap into that Afrikaans market. The problem is they can't speak Afrikaans. So they don't understand the songs that they're singing. Um, but it's, it's a really funny, great movie. John has in fact just come from, back from Cannes. He was, uh, the, the film was showed in Cannes last week. Oh, cool. Um, and there's some very exciting things coming out of that trip. I'm not allowed to say anything about it. I think we're going to be making some big announcements next week. But um, I can say that the response was really amazing and there might even be an international audience for this movie. Who knows? I kind of like what you were saying at the beginning that it was never meant to be a film. That at some point when this, you entered this discussion two and a half years ago, it could have been anything else. It's yeah. now, uh, now a movie. When, when you're as a creative, when you're we're entering those kind of discussions, and I know there's a lot of projects that you enter into discussions too, how was that process, keeping in track with, with John and then eventually developing these characters? Do you go back and you think, okay, well, you know, that we could have maybe done this different now? Or, or is it just something, do you make peace with what you've created? Um, you know, it, it was very much John's baby from the start. And, and like I said, he has an incredible drive. And, and um, it's, it's re I love people who are passionate and who are, mm. think out of the box and are problem solvers. And John is one of those people. He just made this movie happen out of nothing. And... You have to go on a lot of faith, and when you're working with someone who's that driven, it's easy to find the faith, you know. Mm. Um, I just kind of went with it, and it, it, I suppose one of the challenges was we, we shot in blocks over like a year and a half, two, two it's year very period. very difficult. So you got to come back six months later and go, okay, who is this character again? What's the world? <laughs> but luckily the two of us have a great chemistry and, and the, the concept of the script just really works. And I, I think, you know, I say, I say this movie shouldn't have happened, but I think it's precisely because 
he broke all the rules and it isn't like and any other movie you've works. seen. It's just, it just works. Quickly, uh, people at home that want to watch it, when is it available? It's, uh, it's out now. It opened uh, yesterday. It's on this weekend. And we it's want selected. everybody to go and you watch gotta it. Go, I mean, you know how South African cinema works. If you don't watch it in that first weekend, it's dead in the water. Okay. So everybody, it's on New Metro Cinemas. It's selected mm. New Metro Cinemas nationwide. But we also have a very interesting thing. It's available on, so if you have a Sony Xperia device, you can download the movie for free, which is a first for South African cinema. Rob from Fear, and thank you very much for joining us. He's here to talk about the Stole Cold uh, Jane Austen movie. It's out in cinema. Go and check it. New Metro, Google it, find out where it is. Um, Samantha's in studio with us.